When the killer was carrying out his mission, but the sniper lens was blocked by the beauty, the well-trained man quickly moved the scope to the target, but the man's instinct made him unable to help but sneak a peek, the killer realized that this would not work, so he quickly calmed down and looked at his watch, heart rate 65, this is when he is in the best condition. Carl held the gun tightly and concentrated his attention to prepare for a fatal shot, because he had never missed before, as the rich man appeared in sight again. Carl decisively pulled the trigger, but at the critical moment, the beauty suddenly moved her body to catch the bullet, Carl quickly loaded his gun and wanted to shoot again, but the body guard had already discovered his position and quickly closed the curtains, the best sniper usually only has one chance, he quickly put away the gun and picked up the garbage on the ground, then put on the helmet and went downstairs, ride the motorcycle that has been parked at the door, when the police car roared over, Carl had already driven out of the side road, then throw away the magazine, throw away the equipment, take the side road, hide from the police car, then throw the helmet into the river at random, the tools used in the crime were disposed of, then he went to a convenience store, he took the time to go to the bathroom, quickly took off his clothes and washed his body, as a detail control, he even shaved shaved carefully, he sprayed a lot of perfume when he left. Everything was done and he walked out neatly. After hailing a taxi, Carl headed straight to the airport. Before going in, he took out the pistol for self-defense, erased the fingerprints on it, throw it quietly into the trash can. But when he went through security, but he found a police dog staring at him. Although Carl had cleaned the smell on his body, but he still didn't dare to gamble with the dog's nose, so he decisively gave up the flight and turned to the bathroom. He carefully wiped the skin outside again. Even the sink where he had stopped was not spared. Details determine life and death. Carl is never careless, then he bought another flight. But just as he was about to board the plane, the boss called. Carl knew that if the assassination of an important person failed, the killer would sometimes be silenced, so now he is likely to be hunted down on two fronts. After hanging up the phone, Carl pulled out the SIM card and crushed the phone to prevent himself from being tracked. But even so, Carl did not relax after getting on the plane, he kept an eye on his surroundings. It turned out that a man in sunglasses seemed to be monitoring him, so as soon as he got off the plane, Carl took out another fake identity and checked in for a layover. Coincidentally, the man in sunglasses also checked in for a layover, and they ran into each other in the same waiting room. Carl raised the alarm. This person is probably following him. Carl didn't dare to take any risks. He changed his flight to tomorrow morning and checked into the airport hotel and ordered dinner. After confirming that it was the waiter, Carl then stood cautiously by the door. But Carl wasn't really hungry, he just needed some weapons. He put the glass against the door handle, then put the plate close to the door, so that when the door was pushed open, the glass would fall onto the plate and make a sound. Then Carl took the knife and sat in the chair opposite and turned off the light. Fortunately, the night was peaceful, the man in sunglasses did not appear again. Carl then boarded the plane with peace of mind, back to the Dominican Republic. His car was parked outside the airport. Airport, but Carl still didn't relax after getting on the road, he kept changing routes, and avoided driving parallel to any vehicle, because once you're driving at the same speed, a gun barrel could come out of the window at any time. After a whole day of detours, Carl finally got home, but just as he reached the door, he found two large footprints on the ground.